All right, so next week turned into three months later somehow. Sorry guys, you've been asking for a part two for the chicken coop door, and I finally got my double pull, double throw relay in. Today we are going to finish the chicken coop door. Hopefully, I don't know if this is gonna work. I have no idea if this is what I need, but I've got the light switch, I've got the relay, got the motor, let's get this thing done. All right, so from the diagram, apparently these are both normally open and these are both normally closed and these are our commons. And I would be lying to you if I told you I knew exactly what that meant. So let's do some experiments and hopefully we don't blow this thing up. Input, it's something. Well, I'm very confused, so I'm going to do what I always do when I'm confused and watch a YouTube video. All right, it's a mess, but I think I'm starting to get a handle on it. I've got it now to where I can at least close the circuit and it opens and when I pull it off, it closes. Got some bad news, it looks like I fried my light sensor last time I was working on this uh, because on the output I'm showing 12 volts, which during daylight should be zero. And if I cover it up, nothing happens at all. So I'm gonna run a Home Depot and see if I can find some sort of D, oh, there's something. No. Off the top of my head, I can think of three things that might work. A uh, sprinkler timer, a Christmas light timer, or one of those solar operated uh, landscape lights. So a sprinkler timer might be a good option, and I actually never thought about it. The problem is it needs 24 volts DC input instead of 12. <clears throat> Here's a little photo cell for uh, seven bucks. The problem is all these are 120 volt AC, not uh, DC rated, so I don't think that's gonna work. These might work right here. 10 bucks for a solar moonlight bug killer. I've got this one switched on. Cover it up, light comes on. Here's an even better deal, $9 for six of them. All right, so here we have a 12 volt AC. Let's get it hooked up, see what it does. If I shine my light on it, it should click on here in one second. There it goes, cover it up. And there it goes, zero volts. So even though this is rated for 12 volt AC, it's actually working perfectly with 12 volt DC. All right, here is the first attempt. All right, everything is working. The hard part is gonna be fitting it all in here. Kind of like that, and then this. I think that'll work. There we go. That's our positive input, that's our negative, that's our red wire, that's our green wire. Coming out, that's a good sign. But if we put some light on it. Perfect. There it goes. That's good enough for me. Let's do one more test out in the sun and then we'll go install it on the chicken coop. Something's going on here. This thing just keeps popping in and out. I'm a little concerned. Sorry to say this thing is not ready for prime time. It seems to be consistently opening and closing every 55 seconds. So if this thing closes here, two, one, close. There's something very wrong. It's gonna have to wait till next week. Sorry guys, bye.